When I made my bandsaw sled, it had to do a number of things. I made an arm with bearings that ride along a base. The base slides in my bandsaw's miter slot. This makes cutting small pieces easy as I can get closer to the blade and my kerf is much smaller. I wanted it to cut circles, so I created an add-on that stacks on the base. It uses a window and a ruler to let me set measurements away from the blade. It cuts circles based on radius measurements that work off the base ruler, but I didn't want to always add a hole to every piece of stock I wanted round, so I added a turntable that I can add stock to with double-sided tape. What's nice with this jig is that I don't have to rely on thin blades to cut circles, but could instead use the miter slot to move the stock, which means I don't need to switch out my three-quarter inch blade each time. I used a circle protractor and made this jig that clamps to a T-track. If you're interested in any of these, I have three full step-by-step -step pages that will make cutting smaller pieces of stock easier. They're free and have both material and tools used. You can find it pinned in the comments. Sub and follow for more bite-sized tips. Keep making things.